Addictions number 40. Grab a cup and join me. I have um, Jamaican me happy today. I've done a video for the winner of the 800 sub whatever <laughs> giveaway. So if you thought you won and maybe you did, go on over there and watch it anyway because in that winner video there also is the 900 sub giveaway so whatever the winner picks the other package will be the the giveaway for that and just a reminder because i don't think i said it but it's in the description box you do you do need to be sub to my channel you do need to have a united states address to win prizes and please don't put giveaway in your comments so that's over there or down or around or that's the last video that I did <laughs> so what's this video all about well it's an addictions video so I have some smile mail come all the way from Germany and I've waited for it since the beginning of November and it got here yesterday so I want you all to join me and open this beautiful I'm sure package that traveled all the way from Germany and then I have some more smile mail that came from California. So, you know, that's my friend, Kimmy. So I'm going to open those today. And then I'm going to also tell you a little twist that my addictions videos are going to have for the next several weeks. So I hope you just sit back and enjoy. We have a little envelope from Kim. Now this one. I think is pins to start giving out during our lives because she told me that she was sending me some so let's see what they are yes these are hook and stitch live pins whoops let's just take one of these and show you there we go they say hook and stitch live and they have our logo on them. So I can randomly give one of these on the show and put them in with my giveaways. Um, that's why she sent them to me. So the next time I will be giving things away will be on the March 20th show. That'll be our Hat Not Hate show. We will be making blue hats for Hat Not Hate. In fact, I have planning on putting a post up on my Facebook page just for that day. So you can enter some blue hats in early. So I'll be working on that uh, shortly. And then I'm going to be giving out a couple pins that day when we are giving out blue yarn. So that's going to be fun. It is our second annual. It'll be March 20th on her channel at... 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time and what is it 9 a.m. Pacific Time so then she sent me something else and I don't know what's in here because I didn't expect anything else so let's see what's in here uh-oh uh-oh it's a jacquard in cranberry and ivy ivy and cranberry oh good because I only 
I only could get the other ones. Even though I got one, I don't care. I got another one. Thank you, Kim. Thank you so much. This is a Craft Smart yarn. You find it in Michael's. And it's a jacquard, which means it's got a lot of stripes and speckles. And they have it in this Christmas colorway. And we've been talking about it ever since Christmas. And a lot of us couldn't find it. So now I can make some gnomes with this. Uh, gnomes as in my towel topper gnomes. <laughs> so what else is in here? There's something else in here. Thanks, Kim. Oh. Oh, okay. She sent me one of the Hook and Stitch Live and one of uh, the Crafty Nomad buttons. These are for me to keep. So thank you. Thank you so much. She's such a good friend. If you don't know Kim from the Crafty Nomad, her channel will be linked down below. And uh, you can join us live on her channel on March 20th for our next show. Okay, so ooh, did you know that I did a swap with Reggie from J-Hook Crochet? Well, if you don't know Reggie, she's been on the live a lot. And she has her own... Uh, YouTube channel and she is all kinds of all over the place too. She does yarnology or yarn yarnversity. It's very good. And she has a lot of uh reviews on yarn and, and different subscriptions and things like that. She's very interesting. And she lives in Germany, so it's interesting to me because she has yarns and um a lot of hobby uh yarns that I've never tried. And a lot of yarns over there that we don't get that often. So we did a swap and it was in November. And I sent mine out and she got hers right away. She has had to sit on this box for well over three months waiting for this package to get to me. And I felt so bad because it's worse to have the package sitting there and not be able to open it. Than for me waiting for it to come. And, and in fact, yesterday it was sitting in front of the door and I thought that it was not mine because it was packaged like this <laughs> as a handle. I just now zipped the plastic open, the tape open. So it was taped, but it was sitting like this and I didn't know it was mine. So I brought it in the house and I put it in the living room. <laughs> I thought it was Doug's. <laughs> so that... He comes home, like this is hours later, and says, what is that? I didn't order anything. And I said, you didn't? And he said, no, I think it's for you. And I said, what? And I look at it, and it's like, the only thing I can read on the whole entire um, outside of the box is my name, because everything else is <laughs> in German. <laughs> and I'm like, okay, yeah, it's for me. Oh my goodness, so I have not opened this at all. I haven't even looked in it. All I did was cut the tape just now. So let's get in here and see what we got. Well, we have some packing bubbles. <laughs> and we have a card. That's fun, right? I'm going to knock everything all over, getting all excited. <clears throat> okay, so let's open the card, shall we? <laughs> uh-huh. That's right. It's a Christmas card. <laughs> we sent this way before Thanksgiving, so it's understandable that there'd be a Christmas card in there, right? Um, I can't read it, <laughs> so I'll let you read it. Yeah, <laughs> it's beautiful. Wyknick, ten. Something like that. Fro Wyke Dick Tin. Uh -huh. Oh, Reggie, that is beautiful. And the inside of the card doesn't say anything except her own writing. So I can read that. <laughs> she says, and it's, it's not uh, personal. It's very nice. Dear Chris, in this time of social distancing, May this holiday season bring you closer to all those you treasure in your heart. Have a Merry Christmas and a happy, better 
and more joyful new year. Hugs, Reggie. Thank you, Reggie. <laughs> How beautiful. See, and it still brings me joy. It doesn't matter when you get it. Because it's Smile Ma'am. <laughs> okay, well, on the top is definitely snacks. Let's see what we got. Curly Whirly Squirrelies. Curly Whirly Squirrelies. I can't wait to try these. It says it's from Cadbury. And it's reclosable. Oh, wait. These, these are pretzels. I love chocolate-covered pretzels. How did you know? I didn't tell you that. Oh, for heaven's sakes. That is cool. I mean, it doesn't say it's pretzels, but the picture looks like a pretzel. So I'm going to guess that's what it is. Thank you. Oh, boy. See, some things, you know. Let's see. Caramel nibbles. These are Cadbury, too. So these can be eaten at Easter time. Not a problem. I am hoping that she likes the candy I sent her. I sent her, um... Now I can't even remember. <laughs> She'll show you because you've got to go over there to her channel and watch her open her box from me. Just like Rose. Rose was opening the box from me too this week. So it's exciting. Okay. Well, she sent me more goodies and snacks than I sent her. This says Favorina. And these look like cookies. I can't wait to try these. These look yummy. Most of this stuff stayed pretty good because nothing's melted or anything. Of course, it's winter time. And then there's all kinds of yarn in here. Let's see what we got. I'm going to pull out this beautiful one right here. Oh my gosh. This one has Halo and it's purple and I'm in love with it. I want to try it right now okay so it says daylight 100% acrylic and then it says something I can't read opscrift oh I better not even try <laughs> it says bumbo daylight okay I've tried this I got some of this from Hobie with an English written outside label. And I loved it. This looks a lot different, you know, a lot like it. It may not be exactly, but it said something very similar to Bumbo on it. So it, oh my gosh, though, look at the color. And I can't even tell you what the color, well, daylight, Bumbo daylight. How gorgeous. And it's called Favre Party. That is just gorgeous. Thank you so much for these. These are going on my list soon. I have a ton of whips. A ton, I tell you. Okay, what is this one? Ooh, look at that. How pretty. Oh, feels like a, a scrubby yarn with metallic. Let's read about it. We, we can't. <laughs> we can't. Sponge Creative. That's exactly what it is. She got it. Look at that label. See that one? Yeah. It's just like the United States. Just looks a little bit different. 100% polyester. I can read that. Strick, strick garn. All right. Well, that's what that's for is making, making scrubbies or a washcloth. I, I will probably make a washcloth with that or add it to uh, some cotton to give it that scrubby. Yeah, that's cool. That's nice to try that. And there are three colors of it so I've got red green and white perfect for the colors for Christmas for next year 
Doesn't bother me any. I love Christmas all year round, Reggie, so. <laughs> Forgot to say hi to Reggie. Hi, Reggie. All right, let's see. What's in this box? Oh, yes. This was something. I was watching her shopping in her videos because why not? How fun is that? I love to go shopping with everybody, whether it's a store I go into all the time, whether it's a uh, local yarn shop, or whether it's a Dollar Tree store in Germany. You know, I mean, I love it. So she was looking through some stuff, and I was looking at and picking out different things, saying, that looks cool, that looks cool. And, of course, none of this says anything in English in it, but there's three little balls in here, and they look like they're cotton, I believe that they are yeah 100 percent cotton and there is even a picture of some pot holders on the side with what appears to be a possibility of a pattern written in german which is kind of cool i love it i think that is so cool to to get this stuff from another country like that. That is so cool. What is this one? This one. Oh, yes. This is another one that I asked her to send me. How fun is this? Look at this. And this one is a little Christmas sweater kit. Isn't it cute? For your Christmas tree. You make the sweater an ornament. And I'm sure that if it's not written in English... It has the thread, the knit, knitting needles in it too, the darning needle, the clothes hanger to hang it on, and the instructions. If it's not written in English, then I can find one on Ravelry or something to uh, make the sweater out of. But, oh my gosh, that is so cool. <laughs> oh, we should open this one. Oh my gosh, you guys. Look at little DPNs. Oh my gosh. That is the tiniest little uh, embroidery, or what is it, an embroidery needle. It says it's a threading, thread and darning needle. So it's a darning needle. That's the tiniest one I've ever seen. But look at those little DPNs. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. What else is in here? There's a lot of little things in here, the little yarns. All three colors. Look at this tiny little hanger. Oh my gosh, how fun is this? Some uh, gold thread. And then the other two colors, the black and the white. Just enough. And then the instructions. So I wanted to take it out to see if it was in English. Oh, maybe. Of course, that's a graph too. And I haven't done color work before. So... There is an English version and German. That is so cool. And they have more. They have those six kits. So how fun is this? Yep. Okay. So that was that was really fun. I, I don't know if I'll be able to make it, but I can probably give it a heck of a try, right? Okay, what else is in here? I've got four more in here. Woo, what's this? Universe. This is a hobby. Hobby Universe XL. <laughs> Sparkle. Oh, it's gorgeous. It's so soft. Beautiful. Okay, so this one says 98% acrylic, 2% polyester. I can read this. This is in England. Or English. <laughs> it's in England. <laughs> it's a three light. And it has 240 yards. Oh, this is pretty. It has a very nice twist to it, which I like. I like yarns like that. They lay different. Centerful, maybe. Possibly that, let's see, is it calling to me to make? I don't know, 240 yards, probably a cowl. 
We'll see. Thank you. I like that. That's really pretty. I really like that colorway. Does it say the colorway? It says color 15. Yeah, beautiful. Oh, I love it. Thank you. What else do we have? We have something else in here, which also has a beautiful glitter. I don't know if that colorway is even picking up the glitter. Let's see, this one says something I can't pronounce. <laughs> and uh, it's a cake ball. 190 meters. This one actually says multi rosa as the colorway. Again, party. Party must have something to do with the sparkle. It is a very um is that color that I, that I love rose gold sparkle. This is go gorgeous yarn. This is just beautiful. It's Let me see if it has anything else on here. So it's 20% wool, I think. Yeah. Um, it's funny. I have to put my face on it to feel and smell the wool. Um, I don't, I really can't read. It's mostly written in German, but it's just gorgeous. And there's two of those. And then... They're slightly different. Okay. This one is the Multi Rosa. This one is called Rosa. So it's, see how it just changes just a little bit, which is a beautiful fade. That would work out well together. This one is a lot softer and has a little halo. How interesting. And this one doesn't have as, it's not as soft, but you can tell that they're, they're intended to be like in the same line. Okay. And then the third one is again, as soft as the second one. And it is in this colorway and it has a halo. So it's called Bla, B-L-A-U. Or blue and to me that's a lilac aren't these gorgeous together yes okay I can't hold on to them <laughs> all right thank you Reggie oh my goodness thank you so much that's it that's all that's in here thank you so much I waited so long for it how fun is it oh I can't wait to try everything Yes, I like everything. I hope you like your box. I really, really do. Um, so what? Before I let you go, because I'm gonna, I'm gonna close this video, and um, let's see how many minutes we got enough. Okay, so what I'm gonna do? Most times, not today. Today's video does not have a giveaway in it, but most of the time. My addictions videos have a hidden giveaway in them. Today's doesn't because I did a giveaway video by itself for the 900. Thank you. And I'm running that until we hit the 900. However, most of my addictions videos do have a hidden giveaway. And why I'm mentioning it is because I am going to be running a bracket. And what I mean by this bracket is something I came up all by myself. Of course I did. But what I mean is I'm not stealing an old idea from somebody because no one's ever done it that I know of. However, I am going to use a bracket. And how this bracket is going to work is I every time for the next eight times, I don't know when, but when I do a secret addictions giveaway and 
I put it in a video and then I pull a winner. I am going to put that winner's name after they claim it into a bracket. And then when we are, as we fill the bracket up, I will, whenever there's a, a, a part of the bracket that you have to compete, we will run a drawing on that part of the bracket and we will find a winner and that person will advance to the next part of the bracket. So that is how exciting is that going to be? At the end of the bracket, when we get all of the winners paired up and they move to the next and move to the next, then we will, but you'll see how it works. I will have the bracket and I will make make it and I will put in the numbers and how they how we will fill it in. And as we pick a winner from any addictions video, your name will go into a bracket and it will go on and advance on to the next part. So how fun is that going to be? I'm excited. I am so excited about it. I want to even, I just, I, you know what I want to do? I want to put something in this video just because I want to put the first name into the bracket. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yes. Yeah. So what am I going to do? Well, let's see. What do we got behind me? Oh my gosh. There's so many different things behind me to pick from. Hmm. How about two skeins of Sweet Delight Baby B, Sweet Delight Chunky Baby B? How about that? If you would like to win these, you have to have the United States address. You have to comment below Sweet Delight, and I will pick a winner have to have the United States address to win this and I will pick a winner from this video for these two skeins of sweet delight and then that will be your you will also get an entry into the first part of the brackets I'm excited CC addictions brackets <laughs> share with your friends because they're going to want to get in too and we were we will have a little grand prize package at the end of the brackets um for the winner it's not going to be huge but it's going to be a heck of a lot of fun so i hope you'll join me for this this is exciting my next addictions videos are going to be boom 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 because i have monthly subscriptions coming up for march i have mystery bags coming from Hershner's. I have a mystery bag coming from Kramer's. Oh, yeah, we haven't seen one from there yet. So I have like three new addictions videos coming up. And I'll probably have something to give away in each one of them. So don't don't forget, don't write the word giveaway in the uh in the comments below, just the words sweet delight and any other comments that you would like to add. And I am going to call it a day. And I'm hoping I will see you Sunday for the next Christie's Closet Live. And um, we are going to be starting a new make-along on Sunday. And it'll be a crochet capelet. I hope you'll all join me for that. The knit one will be going on still. It was continuing on for three weeks, so... It still gives time for you to catch up. There it is over there. That's the knit one. And uh, the crochet one is not started. I mean, it's not like I don't have it finished because I do it along with you guys. So, you know, <laughs> I kind of do a week ahead is all. And how fun is that? I mean, I am just loving this channel. I can't wait till we hit 900 to see who that one will be. So make sure you share. Thanks, guys. I'll talk to y'all later. Bye now.